Now we're in Articuno territory down in Seafall Islands. And look, as you saw, that was the Articuno Master. They had Pokemon Masters here. All different types of Pokemon. Well, Pokemon experts. But funny how he's right here. The last legendary bird that we need to catch. And then we can head to Cerulean K right after this to try to find Mewtwo. This is one of my personal favorites of the Tiger Legendary Birds of GM1. So we got a battle as usual. So he's an Ice and Flying type. So let's get right at him. Ooh, Ice Beam. I was trying to poison him. Same thing I did to Zapdos. Yeah, see? Not gonna do nothing now. See, can't handle our defenses. We got this in the back. Oh, Agility. See? Now nah, nah, it's gonna be faster again. It's gonna be faster than me. But it's not like it'll matter. It's my defense there. My defense is... Maybe high up. So we'll be able to get him. It's really well now. See, and the good thing is, got him. The good thing is he didn't freeze me. Now it's our turn to catch Articuno. This. Wow, immediately. Well, wow, right off the bat. No, it would have been just like Motris if I would have got him. Second try. Close again. See, he, he seems easier. He seems way easier. So I should be able to get him. It shouldn't take me that long. Now it's, now it's like, it's like it's tougher than I uh, know. I'm gonna get him. I'm gonna catch him. No! <laughs> Come on!
No! I'm, I'm just, I'm gonna still get him. I'm gonna get him. I just, he seems a lot easier. There you go. Now I got him. <laughs> there we go. Got him. Only took five minutes. A lot quicker than uh, Zapdos was. We got him now. Freeze Pokemon. It freezes water that is contained in winter and winter air and makes it snow. The legendary freeze Pokemon. Now I can go to Serena K and catch the legendary Mewtwo as the last, the last legendary. We're in Mewtwo's battle. Here he is, right here. We jump right into it. That's Serena K. I had to look up where to how, how to get to him because I didn't know where to go. So we're in a battle with him right now. Look how strong he is, level 70. Dang, look at that. Not very effective, but it was very effective. You see that, how much damage she just did? They didn't even do much to him because that amnesia. It's going to be difficult trying to get her, but you know what? I was I had I started with Starmie on purpose because I know I know that he's a psychic type, so I'm gonna have Muck come out to try to inflict some damage, and then my strongest Pokemon is Pikachu since he's in the 60s to try to inflict some damage to get to get the moves off quicker because he has a recover. I know he does. Boom, see? There you go. Drop his defense. See? Now he's, now he's gonna recover. You can't keep doing that forever. Cause you only, I think you only can use it five or ten times. I think you only can use it tw ten times. He's gonna be on the defensive. I'm gonna be just on the offense. See, and I'm doing more damage. His defense fail. So we'll be able to catch him. The last legendary of the game for Gen One, and he's the strongest. Got him. It's only a matter of time. Let's t let's catch you too. Let's try to catch him. Wrap this up. Wow. There you go. That's some ugly girls. And he jumped out. He popped out right off the bat. I'm gonna try to use some of these regulars. See, it's not going to it. It's not even. The throws don't matter. I don't think it matters. Look. Nearly had them. See, when it, it, what I didn't know is that if they have this little field where when I try to throw the berries at, at them, it's like they, it, they don't take them. It just blocks it. See? It's like some kind of energy field. They all had it. Dang. See, it's gone now. And now they take it. And then the field is back on. I didn't even notice that. That's how you can get them. See, I could I think I could have caught the made it a little bit better, but he still broke out anyway. It didn't matter. See? 
It seems like I'm gonna have to wait. Seems like she has just did that, and it doesn't come up on the screen. And then it goes away again. And now it's back on. I'm in some bathrooms. I'm trying to. I might as well just wait and try to wait till he gets into the middle. Because that's the, that's the better way, so I'm not wasting the Ultra Ball. Have. See, it's, it's just it comes and goes. See, it's just like it doesn't matter. And then it once it goes goes away, he puts it back on. See? Now it's gone. Watch this. Now it's now it appears. So maybe I'll get the benefits. So. See? And I caught him. I ended up catching him. See, it could have been a lot easier. I, I was spending all that time just trying to waste all those berries trying to capture Zapdos and all the legendaries. But I didn't even need it for Moltres because I only caught I caught him my second try. It's wild. Here he is. Its DNA is almost the same as Mew's, however, its size and disposition is very different. So we got all the legendaries. All the legendary Pokemon. So I can do whatever I want to now. I can just battle all the little masters. There they are at the bottom. All the little legendaries. Aerodice is pretty legendary too because he's from a fossil. But I really have fun with this. I wanted to just get the legendaries last. But I got Moltres while I was at Victory Road. While I was there. It was just in the moment. But we got him now. We got all our legendaries, Mewtwo, Articuno, all our legendary birds. But I hope you guys have fun watching, so I'm not going to do anything else. I'll just probably just be battling and just catching the other Pokemon on my own. But I'm looking forward to Gen 8. Gen 8 awaits us later on this year.